Tim, what do we know? I mean, Boris Johnson has been very quiet, right? But he's a staunch pro-Brexit, as is Michael Gove. So they were going to have issues with what Theresa May has put on the table. Well, what seems to have happened is that Theresa May went to Brussels on Monday, having not quite squared off either the Democratic Unionist Party or everybody in her own cabinet about exactly what she was looking to do in terms of that deal. So it, it looks like she's in trouble on two fronts there. OK, who would, should she worry more about? Arlene Foster? I mean, again, if the DUP, they have, you know, this is a supply and agreement deal, if they take away the votes, then they don't get any money. So how easy will it be to placate Arlene Foster as compared to Boris Johnson, who may want to become prime minister? I think the difficulty is that there are competing demands on Theresa May. She needs, actually, to be frank, she needs them both. She can't afford to lose the support of Boris Johnson in Cabinet. He's too big a figure and that would bring her premiership probably crashing down, I would imagine. Secondly, if she loses the DUP, she'll, she, they will lose the money from the central government, but she potentially will lose power in the House of Commons, so there won't be a Theresa May government anymore. OK, uh, Tim, how much do we know that, you know, if, if Theresa May was actually mad at the fact that Michel Barnier on Monday said, we're going to get an agreement and say so it looks now very bad, it almost looks like she's failed? Yeah, I think I got a sense on the day that May's office, her team, were not very happy with the fact that the detail of that deal began to leak out before she'd even sat down to have lunch with Barnier at the, at the dining table in the Commission headquarters in Brussels. But I also feel that it's quite possible um, that uh, this, this deal was close to being done and there's a degree of political management going on on the Irish side now that is more perhaps for show than for substance.